Welcome back to the Forked Road. So just doing a quick little video to go ahead and go over the different ways to install the different forks on your device. Currently we have Frog Pilot installed. So I'm going to go ahead and first go over how to get rid of the software on your uh, Comma AI device. This is the 3X. It should be pretty similar for all the other models, but this is specifically for the 3X. If you do have, uh, if you already have the, if you, the device brandly set, new, set up there and you don't have a software install, go ahead and jump to this time marker ahead, and that is where we're going to go over the instructions for there. So from here, we need to go ahead and go into settings. We need to go ahead and go to the software. And then we have always the uninstall frog pilot, or whichever one you have there is going to be right there. If we tap on uninstall, do you want to delete deep storage? Uh, yes, we're going to clear everything. Go ahead and wipe it completely clean. And it's going to restart itself. It has a confirmation screen for us, so we're going to go ahead and click confirm. Are you sure? Confirm again. Now it's going to reset the device. This will take up to a minute, so I'm going to go ahead and speed this up for you. And here we have the Getting Started page. So this is what you'll have if you have the first time you're setting this up. So we'll go ahead and press Continue. We do have to connect to an internet connection. I'm going to go ahead and get this connected to my Wi-Fi network, and we will continue from there. So once you type out your password, it'll connect to the Wi-Fi. It'll wait for internet. Once it has internet, we can press the continue button. Now if you want the regular default OpenPilot software, all you have to do is tap on OpenPilot right there. However, if you're trying to install a fork, like I would assume you would if you're watching this channel, we want to tap on custom software, then continue. And then here's the most important part. This is where you're going to enter the URL for the different fork that you want to install. I'm going to go ahead and show you three of them here. The first off is Sunny Pilot. So I'm going to go ahead and type that in. And there we have the Sunny Pilot installer website. So if you need to go ahead and install Sunny Pilot, that's what you would do. And you need to press next. I'm going to go ahead and type out the Frog Pilot one next. Frog Pilot is a little bit simpler than most of the other ones. It's just frogpilot.download. So that would be for Frog Pilot. And you would press continue. And then I'll go ahead and do the last one here, Dragon Pilot, the one we're actually going to install here and go through the installation and setup for. And there we have the website URL for Dragon Pilot. This is their current release. So if you want to take a look at that one more time, we're going to go ahead and press continue and have it download the Dragon Pilot for us. And we will go through the setup for Dragon Pilot. All right, well, we're back here to the custom software page. I tried to install Dragon Pilot, but it was stuck on 0% for more than 5 minutes or so. I'm going to go ahead and just install Sunny Pilot again, so that way I can have that up and running, and we will try to get Dragon Pilot installed another time. Alright, so one more time for the Sunny Pilot installer, installer.comma.ai slash sunnyhybin slash release dash hc3. Go ahead and press download, and there we go, that's what we're supposed to see. Installation happening right away. And there we go. So after it's installed, you always get the terms and conditions here. So you do have to scroll through these here. You do indemnify yourself and everything like that does bring you through the training here. So we're going to go through this training. So we have begin training. We have the open pilot screen here. What is open pilot? Let's you know that you need to keep your eyes on the road. You can take over at any times. You will be ready to take over. Explains the driving path. Then you tap on the driving path. The lead car indicator about that how to engage and control open pilot with your steering wheel, how to engage it with the set button, driver monitoring that it watches you as you're driving to make sure you're paying attention. Uh, it'll distract you. If you're distracted driving, it'll notify you while you're driving. Tap through that. Whether you want to improve driver monitoring, we're going to press no for that. 
It can adjust the max speed, how to change lanes, about just turning it on, then waiting for the right spot, and then starting to turn, how to disengage with the brake, the limited features, talking about not stopping at red lights, how to disengage with the brake, goes over an overview of what you need to do here, what not to do or what it can't do, and then we finish the training, and interesting, it's bringing us to the terms again, which we already agreed to, and there we go, we are into Sunny Pilot 0.9.7.1. So that's what we're going to call it an end today for. Let me know if you have any other questions or any other videos you want to see in the future. And uh, thanks for making it this far into the video. If you did make this far, make sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace out.